love with conditions. It's not love at all. It is not. So many people say that they love you or they use this love word. And then within a week or a year, I hate you. How can you love a person then within a year you hate them? How can you lose love that quickly or lose love at all? When you love a person, my Lord, you can't lose love so quickly. So obviously, when you said that you loved a person, obviously, that is not real love because you can't lose love within a year. Listen, love with conditions <laughs> is not love at all. I believe back in the old times, the word love was not passed around so easily. Love with conditions is not love at all. Are you still going to love that person when they lose their job? Are you still going to love that person or people when you don't feel appreciated or when you feel like you are mistreated? Are you still going to love that person when things are not as good as they are now? Are you still going to love that person? For many, no. Then what you are feeling for that person is not love. Perhaps it is lust. Some people mix in lust or love with lust. Or no, some people mix up lust with love which is crazy. What is your point, Kevin? Okay, give me time. Give me time. God wants us to have unconditional love for people. It is easy for me to love people that say nice things to me. Or it is easy for me to say that I love you when you say nice things to me. It is easy for me to say I love you when times are always good between you and I. But what about if times get rough? What about if we have a misunderstanding? What about we disagree with each other? Are you still going to love me? Will I still love you? I can't say that I love you when times are good. Then I don't love you when times are bad. In order to get into heaven, listen now, listen, listen, listen. In order to get into heaven, yes, we have to have unconditional love for everyone. Agape love, meaning no matter what you do, no matter what you say, no matter what you think about me, I am going to love you. I am going to help you. There is nothing that you can do or say that is going to change my feelings about you. Unconditional love. Sometimes it is going to take 
love to change people other than words. A person can teach you about God or talk to you all day long, but how many people are going to be willing to deal with a difficult person no matter what? My Lord, there are people with rejection issues. If a person has been rejected so much in life, what are your words to them? Your words may not even reach them. The way that you are going to reach them is by showing them unconditional love. Your love is going to speak more than words, my Lord. I am telling you. Sometimes you don't have to say a word to people. All you have to do is show them unconditional love, agape love. I am telling you. Love with no conditions. Hey, I am going to love you even if you mistreat me, even if you backstab me, even if you steal from me. I am going to love you no matter what. I am going to help you no matter what. That is what changes people. Well, Kevin, you know, I don't want to be mistreated because, you know, I only think about myself. Yes, I know. I understand that. But that is not going to take you too far. So many people wants to go to heaven or want to go to heaven, but you are not willing to do what it takes to get there. I want to go to heaven. So I am willing to do whatever to get there. I don't want to go to hell. If God will allow sinful people into heaven, like people who are purposely like, hey, I don't care. I am just going to do me. I am just going to sin all day long. If people, if God allows people like that in heaven, you know what? Heaven would be similar to earth. And I don't want to live in a second earth. I don't. I don't. I want peace. I want love. I want to live where demons are not. <laughs> My Lord. So I pray that this makes sense. Show love. Unconditional love. Love changes people. Not so much your words. People can talk all day long. People can lie. So many people lie. It is crazy. And it is usually the people that talk so much, like keep on talking. <sighs> Chances are. Sometimes, I guess I can say that. It is usually the people who talk so much are usually the one that lie a lot. So what are words when you don't have action backing up your words? I can say that I love you, but if I don't show it, what good are my words? Empty. 
So let me stop here. God bless you.